Hello everyone. Back again with English theater. Today, I have brought a 2014 romantic drama film named Black Panther. Before we get into the storyline, don't forget to like and subscribe to get a more movie recaps like this and have a great day. The movie begins with a woman named Emily. Since childhood Emily has a close relationship with her brother, but in recent years, they have been separated by distance. And they are busy looking for a new life in order to survive, especially since their parents died. Until one day, Emily returned to her hometown in Switzerland with her husband whose name is Andreas. They both went to the house left by his parents. There are many memories in the house. Later they think to sell Emily's father's house because their department business was about to lose. So they want to get money by sale the house and restore the running of the company. Later when they both are looking for the house, Emily brother returned to her, who named Jacob. Emily was so happy to see her brother after long years. In happiness, Emily also told Jacob that he grew taller than me. Later at night Jacob came again to see Emily. She feels that why he came to see her in the middle of the night. In the next day, Emily and Andreas tried their best to get contacts of buyer to sell the house. But they both are new to the place, so they can't get touch with buyers. One day, Andreas returned to his city for a week to meet a client who deals with the company problems where Emily was staying alone in her father's home. Emily saw Jacob that he getting fresh air and outside without any worries. Jacob's life may be more stable than Emily, and he is a professional skateboarder who has traveled to several countries. That afternoon Jacob went to the market, and there he saw a newspaper in which it mentioned that a few days ago in their small town, there was a black panther, which is very dangerous one, was hiding in someone's backyard. So the local government asked people's to be careful, especially at nightfall. While Andreas, who was going to meet a client, met Jacob on the way, He asked Jacob to support and take care of Emily while he was away. But Jacob looked quite indifferent and cold, which makes Andreas to get irritates. Later Jacob returned home. Meanwhile Emily was throwing things which was not useful for anything. Jacob came and talked with Emily while their conversation starts. He told Emily that he knew about Emily and Andreas department problem and the planning about sale the house, which is also the share of Jacob. Jacob also feels that Emily has changed. and barely recognizes her brother but emily denies this and told that she can't forget her brother but after all jack and emily also don't want a dispute between them later jacob gives a newspaper which has the information about the presence of a panther around them because he just wants emily to be careful not to take this as a joke that night when emily was going to sleep she felt alone when andreas was not near her at morning jacob come to home trying to make a meal feel bored Later he finds his father's old motorbike, but it looks broken. So he fixes bike and takes Emily for a walk. They both were very happy together in the beautiful and charming scenery. That day Jacob share his feelings on Emily by telling that he miss her for a while. And he also told that he was happy now to be with her. Emily told him that they both together with their parents in their childhood times, and she also told him that she wished to happen it again, even though she have a boyfriend. and even Jacob was her brother. Emily imagines that she and Jacob will live together like lovers. Later they both spends time together in the forest while reminiscing about their childhood time. But suddenly, quite aware of some group of men appeared to be shouting because they wanted to find the existence of the panther. Of course, they wanted to catch it and return it to its habitat. But the existence of the panther around did not make them flinch. Later, Emily feels to go home. because it was getting dark after returning home before going to sleep emily changed her dress but behind that this time emily saw jacob and started to feel something unusual later they both gets into love which was cut off few years ago the night turns to be more passionate love for both of them they both started to be together everywhere because they feels that they can't leave each other they felt the world belongs to the two of them even when andreas calls her Emily did not respond for his call. When Emily and Jacob returned their home after some days, there was a man who intended to buy their house. But Emily surprisingly wanted to delay the sale of their house. She asked the man to call her husband first. And the man then tried to contact Andreas. At that time, Jacob began to realize one thing. He felt that he was only being used by Emily 
so that Jacob wanted to put down the house sales letter by signing on it, even though Emily had explained lot, but Jacob was still annoyed. He then left Emily, who had been crying, because of the argument between them. Emily was afraid and even regretted doing all that. To be honest, she has no intention of selling the house, but because of Andreas who need funds, she accept to sell the house. In the morning, Andreas wakes Emily, saying that someone wants to buy their house, so Emily had to get ready to leave the house, and still had a few things to pack until noon. Later when they are about to leave, suddenly Emily said, that she would not sign the letter for some reason. It was clear, Emily cares for Jacob, so she want to leave Andreas and want to join with Jacob. That it was no matter for her, what the circumstances saw and know about Jacob and Emily relationship. Andrea realized that Emily had an unusual relationship with Jacob. But he still decided to be with Emily, and while on the way to meet prospective buyers, Andreas rest motorbike and went for some work, at that time Emily think hard, and signed in the document which it means to sell the house. And kept the document in car before she leaves. When Andreas returned to car, he saw the documents in which Emily signed and left from there. He knows that Emily will not be separated from her brother, because it's a special and forbidden relationship. Their mood is strong, and inseparable even though their parents house already sold. But as long as they are together, they will still find a way for them by being together. And the movie ends here. If you like the story, then do watch the full film. Don't forget to leave a comment down below. Kindly like the video, and subscribe to my channel, and hit the notification bell, so you don't miss any of my new videos. See you on the next video.